the ball for Cott. Trying to shape for an offload, but Cam McInnes wasn't letting that happen. The dummy half, creative kick, and the front row! Cut hideous! Following through for the easiest try he'll ever score, and it's back on again here for PNG. Well, somehow he jumps out to the left-hand side, kicks the ball, and it screws around to the right-hand side for the front rower to break through the line. And pretty much no one was near the ball. The ball was sitting there for a couple of seconds, pretty much on its own. And number nine kicks for number eight. International Rugby League is just the future of our game. Like, it's just got to be more of it. And it's got to be cultivated better. It's got to be run by the NRL to make sure more scenes like this happen more regularly. Listen to this crowd and what it's doing. I still don't know how that happens. How do you get the ball to go backwards? It just took a right-hand turn. There were no green jerseys anywhere.